Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome, guys. We're starting with the truth deck. We're gonna see what comes out from your person, whoever you're dealing with, right? Let's see. Let's just dive in, see what's going on. Holy Spirit. What's going on? Oh, pretending to be happy. So your person is not happy, right? Either you're in a connection with each other and they're pretending to be happy or you separated from each other and you're they're pretending to be happy or they're in another connection and they're pretending to be happy, right? So it's different for everyone. Holy Spirit. Oh, they said stop texting me all day long. They said it's too much. So somebody may not be happy in their connection with you. I created a mess. Lies on top of lies. Mm. Holy Spirit. These cards are talking. I'm actively separating and they're doing anything to slow down the process. So your person, they probably lied to you about a connection that they're currently in. And they're separating from this connection. Possibly even living with this person because they never told you. And you keep calling and texting. Well, you keep texting all day long. But if they're still around other people, they really can't, you know, be texting like that, I suppose. Uh, but they're actively separating, right? And they're pretending to be happy. So they're not happy where they're at. They're not happy in the situations that they're in happy of the situation that they put you in with the I created a mess and lies on top of lies. Holy Spirit for the collective. I saw the coffin. Holy Spirit, what is going on? The butterfly. This relationship is evolving. Evolve into the next phase. They're trying to heal their inner child. So maybe the connection with you is evolving and they're pretending to be happy where they're currently at. Yeah. They do have unconditional love for you, affection, passion, all of those things. They just say you text too much. So they do love you and that your relationship is evolving to the next phase. But in the meantime, between time, they're actively leaving a situation that they probably didn't tell you about. They're reminiscing. They're trying to learn from the past and make new memories with you. So they are thinking about the person that they're walking away from. But um, they're going to learn from that past so they can make new memories with you. They do love you. They just didn't tell you that they was in a situation. And then there's the ex, the ex, which came out with I'm actively separating. So this is a breakup, a separation, the silent treatment, abandonment. So your person is actively leaving a situation and they love you. They love you. They feel that your relationship is growing, it's evolving, um, it's getting better. They're attracted to you, you two have passion. Um, they just felt to tell you that they were in another situation. But they are giving that person the X. They say you got to go, right? So somebody got to go. Holy Spirit, what's going on? This person could have been talking to the moon or whatever. Um, they're definitely working on something. They're, something that they worked on, guys, they're reaping rewards from that. So something good is happening in this person's life. Even though they do have some bad, they still have some good. So something from their past. They're reaping rewards from something that they did in the past. And they're finding their balance. Either that or this is you. Because you could be very balanced. You could be reaping rewards from something. Maybe that you thought it was an illusion. Maybe you didn't think that it was going to come to fruition. 
but it did. So you're over here, you're balanced, but your person, the ones that's ending the situation here, they're in the middle of a tower. Look at this tower. That tower is going down, right? A lot of arguments, a lot of fights. Maybe even throwing clothes and shoes. Who knows? Holy Spirit for the collective. Yeah, they're taking their love from this person. Ace of Cups in reverse. I think they're realizing they don't love this person. They're definitely being quite persistent uh, moving forward. They do have some sleepless nights, though. They do have some sleepless nights, probably when it comes to you, because they see that your energy is so balanced. This was a Ten of Cups. They could they could have had a family. It doesn't necessarily have to be, but it was a whole situation. It could have been marriage when they said they're separating here. But the tower is with the Ten of Cups here. Or maybe they want the Ten of Cups with you, and that's creating their tower as well. This person is excited about moving forward, guys. I think they just realized they didn't follow their intuition when it came to whoever they were with or however they proceeded. They got the Page of Pentacles, too. So they're starting completely over. And they're going to be able to plan the life that they want. Three of Pentacles. They think you two will work well together. I think this is the Ten of Cups with you. They think you two work well together. Like as a couple and stuff like that. Holy Spirit, clarify this tower. Six of Cups in reverse. They do not want to go back to that past. It's the Ten of Swords in reverse. Uh, they could have some delays. It could have been somebody that they went back to. But they said that they're not going back this time, right? Holy Spirit, clarify this actively separating. And they're doing anything to slow down the process. Spirit, why are they trying to slow down the process? Because they have regrets. And they still love this person here. Mm-hmm. Holy Spirit. It was injustice. That's why they took their love back. Ace of Cups in reverse. And they're over it. They're on the other side of it. So your person was going through something. They was ending something. They didn't follow their intuition. Spirit, clarify this high priestess in reverse. They didn't follow their intuition. Yeah, Seven of Swords in reverse. They didn't want to believe that this person was betraying them. They was like, no, they didn't do it. They didn't follow their intuition. They didn't want to believe that this person did what they did. But they did. And it ended in a Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Eight of Pentacles in reverse is on the bottom. Ten of Wands in reverse is on the bottom. So they're definitely dropping their burdens. They're not putting in any more work or time into that situation. Then you have Lovers in reverse. So they're ending that situation. And then we have the Star card in reverse. That was not their wish fulfillment. And then we have five of pentacles. They're walking away. Walking away with the food card here. So they're definitely going to take this leap of faith with you guys. This person is coming. Well, they, they're already here in your energy. They just didn't tell you that they were in another situation. Mm -hmm. But it looks like by the time it gets to you, they're on the other side of it. Let's see what your angels have to say. Holy Spirit, any messages for the collective? Healthy lifestyle. Eat a healthful diet, get adequate, adequate sleep, and exercise regularly for optimal health. So Spirit wants you to, you know, work out, eat right, you know, do those type things. Holy Spirit, and then we have prioritize. Focus on your highest priorities. I will help you get organized and motivated. Mm -hmm. So while your person is working on this, you guys, you just keep working out. You keep eating healthy and get anything else that needs to be in order in order. Plus it's fall. You know, like fall, we start putting away the summer clothes. We start doing this. That's also a good time, guys, to declutter closets. 
get rid of things you haven't seen or touched that's not a memorabilia um clean your garage whatever i don't know your storage unit just get rid of things so while your person's doing that they do love you but keep yourself busy as well all right guys thanks for watching please like share and subscribe peace